hello welcome back to my channel um today as you can tell by the title it's gonna be a uh, pokemon go i'm really addicted to this game i actually mentioned it a year ago before it was released that i was like, so excited for this game i've been playing it since it got released i think in july or august i'm not sure what around that time period it got released and it was just a very popular game now it has cooled down a bit a lot of people don't play it as much like a lot of my friends but I still play it and I'm so addicted and actually I save a lot of evolu evolutions right now. I'm at level 24. I'm going to hit 25 very soon right now with all these um, evolutions I'm going to do. And I'm just going to show you all the evolutions I want to do. I'm right here at my house. Um, unfortunately, with an iPhone, you cannot film while you're on the go. And this is the only place I feel very appropriate for filming. Also, it's very comfortable. I can sit down and film instead of being in an awkward space with all these people, um, with all the people in the crowd just look at me. Um, but yeah, this is all evolution. I'm gonna put a lucky egg on right now. I'm gonna probably evolve about like 12 or 15 of them. I'm not sure yet. I haven't seen all the evolution in total. So let me show you. And if you guys are interested in Pokemon Go, um, I will put the link below on how to download it. Also, um, I mentioned previously that I mentioned that I was waiting for it to open or to, you know, go on the iPhone. Um, so yeah, I'll link that above here. Um, let me know what you think. Um, are you still playing Pokemon Go? If you are, just comment below that you're playing Pokemon Go and what team you are. And let me show you my Pokemon Go. So this is my iPhone. I'm gonna click on Pokemon. You can still tell I have a lot of apps. I'm gonna zoom in a little bit closer so you can see. As you can tell, I have the gym very far away from me. Um, and then right here, let me click on my profile. You see, I'm so close to, if we can focus, um, level 25. Uh, my buddy is a Squirtle. And I'm right here. I'm Team Mystic, of course. Very popular team, so here you go. And then, yeah. So let's exit that. Okay, so we're going to involve a lot of Pokemon. Let me put my items list. So let me put... I don't have a Lucky Egg. Oh, great. I don't have a Lucky Egg. But let me go buy that at the store. So I can buy one for 80, which I have enough. Okay, exchange. Cool. So I'm gonna put that on. Awesome. 30 minutes of lucky egg. Should have bought that when they had that special. Anyways, Pokemon, I'm gonna arrange them by name because I actually when I feel like they are ready to evolve. I have them initialed. If you can focus, my camera really sucks. Anyways, it's a happy smiley face with the, and then uh, upper, I'm gonna E. So for the ones that I'm gonna evolve for sure are um, that little sim. Anyways, it's the upper one, upper E, which means evolve. Okay, I'm gonna evolve him. get his name some of these Pokemon I already have so I have already have Magneton um because you know Magnemite um I'm just gonna put that he is a really good Pokemon like the best rank and then that's what I'm gonna do and he got Thundershock and Flash and then I got this, this from Oakland so so you guys know I live in the Bay Area so the next one is a Mankey. Um, I'm gonna involve him. I love Pokemon so much. I used to. This came out when I was a little girl, so that's why I'm so obsessed. So let's evolve him. So Growlithe.
Pokemon. I'm gonna evolve his Executive. Let's evolve him. Marathon Pokemon. Some Pokemon are new, some Pokemon are not. I'm gonna let you know what they're new. This one is not. I already had this Pokemon. I um, just wanted higher stats. Also, like, points, experience points. Fast forward through these evolutions and just make it so fast that you guys know how many Pokemon I evolved. Come on, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get Tentacruel for the first time. Let's evolve. Seriously, if you ever seen Pokemon, this episode was when they were stuck in the island and the island was being attacked by Tentacruel because... There was being, um, they were just being un attacked by the humans of the island, which is pretty cool. For the first time, I get Tentacruel. Let's set, reset his name. And I'm gonna make sure that I know that he is a good Tentacruel. There you go. And I got this one since it's the first, and I got an old one as well. Okay, cool. The next Pokemon is my little buddy, Squirtle. Uh, I have him. He's the best Pokemon I have. A Squirtle. I'm gonna evolve him to an version of War Torter, which I already have. Renaming the Pokemon to know how to. To evolve them and what stats they are, or like, um, like waiting to put an egg. I learned all of this from like two Poke uh, YouTubers. Um, one is called Trainer Tips. He has a really cool like filming technique. Like the way that he films is really pretty, and he gives really useful um, tips. I find his videos a little bit too long for me, but um, whatever tip I I watch the first ten minutes of it and then. I try to figure it out by myself after that. Another person that I follow a lot, and it's just more for the adventures, not for the tips, is um, Allie and his girlfriend, uh, Clara, I think. Um, I'll link those YouTubes down, but they're really helpful in the sense that you get to see what kind of Pokemon they always come across and when they decide to evolve and stuff like that. And it's, more, it's really cute when they bring out their little dog, who's named Eevee, and it looks like an Eevee. Um, so cute. The dog is so cute. Um, those are people I follow, and those are people I watch. Um, not always for tips, but just like for like to see how other people play and stuff like that. It's pretty cool. Butterfree, which is my one of my favorite Pokemon. Um, really was heartbroken when Butterfree decided to go his own path. It broke my heart when I used to watch Pokemon. Um, um, so there's this scene with Metapod where he is crying because he thinks Ash left him because there was an attack of Beedrills and the Beedrills adopted him and put him in a cocoon kind of like tree where all the other um, Beedrills were protecting their little um, evolved versions. Uh, it was really interesting. But then um, Ash went to come and rescue him and that's when he became Butterfree, which is a really cool episode. That's why I love the Pokemon. Oh, level 25. Awesome. I got an Ultra Balls, Max Potions. Awesome. And let me, okay, let's check how much. So I have 14,379 points just from evolving all those Pokemon, which is pretty good because That'll probably get me like a month right there. Pokédex. So I need. I have. I caught 126. I seen 134. And I think the number for the Pokédex is 172. Well, some of the Pokémon you can't still get, but okay. Um, and evolve this one. So I'm just evolving um, filler evolutions by the time we, my egg finishes up to get extra points. I'm just keep working up the ladder on the 25th, level 25. 
I'm just looking for Pokemon to evolve. I got 12,000 experience points, so I'm up to 29. So before that, I had, I don't know how many experience points I got, but it got me over the last tidbit of the 24 into the 25 with 14,000 on the 25. And now I have 29 in total. And look at my buddy. He's all grown up. It's pretty awesome. So that's my Pokemon Go. I think I hope you guys like it. I really am addicted to this game. I play it every time I'm outside my house. Um, it's just always attached to me. I'm that person who has an extra battery pack of my bag just because I need it in case, you know, with Pokemon Go. And it's really fun. Um, I just hope that they release the series too and then get us involved um, by, or battling with our friends because that was the moon. The main purpose like a lot of my friends left is because we can't battle each other. We have to battle at gyms and just the battling kind of techniques are very kind of not like the Pokemon GameCube that I used to play which is like you attack, you choose attacks and you're not just given a set attacks. You're you're allowed to pick from one that you're given like out of four attacks that you were given. Um, so Pokemon still has a long way to go. I don't think it has completed that I died. I have gone through a lot of gyms and battles and I don't usually stay there for very long after um, even though my Pokemon is really strong. There's always people constantly battling the gyms specifically in very popular areas but like I have had the Pokemon stay in a gym for like five days so that's pretty cool. Um, it's just I don't know. I think I like it. I love it a lot. It just reminds me a lot about the Pokemon um, episodes I used to watch when I was little. I did stop watching the series after I got a little bit older because I was thinking that the Pokemon to me were getting uglier. Um, they were not really creative with their Pokemon or they were super creative that I didn't think they were really nice looking. But if you guys like Pokemon Go, let me know on the comments below. Let me know what team you are. I'm Team Mystic again. Um, I just evolved so many Pokemon. I don't even know how many numbers I evolved, but it was pretty a lot Pokemon. We took 30 minutes of my lucky egg, so and I lost like about, let's say probably five minutes like talking to you guys and like um, trying to get my camera to work. But anyways, don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you guys want to learn more about lifestyle. Um, I'm into technology a lot. I'm into DIYs. See you guys next time and thank you guys for watching. Bye.